Hi, it's Wasabi, welcome back to the channel. This battle is on the Paris map and it's El Comandante again from Fidi Clan. He's in a bit of a roll. This time he's in the um, Oni, which is the uh, tier 7 uh, Japanese heavy tank line. So he's top tier in this game. Um, um, down to tier 6. So he's heading to the um, traditional area where the heavy tanks sprawl. And he's just yeah, checking out um, the angles as well. Yeah. Okay, he takes a shot from a Struv M42 which bounces and a bounce from a T-34 so we're going to see a bit of this from the lower tier tanks this got uh, decent armour particularly when it's angled and although the um, HE has been nerfed a bit uh, he's using the heat round so let's have a look at that again average pen of 150 and we'll do 700 damage which you just did to the, um, the T-34-85 there and then he just pumps around into the SU-152, takes him down to one shot of all, at least from his gun. So he's already, it's two shots, he's up to 1300 damage and he's already blocked 1700 uh, with his armour. So you can see here he's just tempting them to shoot and once they've shot he knows he's got at least a certain amount of time before um, they'll shoot again so he can target them with his rounds. Now you can see he's looking for that green um, dot in the middle which tells you that it's pinnable. Um, a lot of people have been firing HE recently saying it doesn't do anything. Well that's because it's not pinning you need to try and aim more carefully. Now he's got a mission running let's have a quick look at that. Oh, he's doing result improvements for heavy tank 12 um, which needs to block 4650 or three times his own hit points and do 2000 hit points of damage so this has been an ideal tank to do that mission in certainly for this tier. Yeah, took his first bit of damage there from a Tiger 1 and the Tiger 1 basically yeah, missed getting uh, shot by Kami. Yeah, a bit more damage there from a VK so he's just not ang angling quite enough. Um, a bit tricky there. Deletes the VK so thank you for shooting me. Take this in return. And he's got an OI up there which is the tier 6 version of the tank that he's in. And again he's just uh, looking for this opportunity to shoot once he's bounced one. Okay now he looks like he's bounced enough now. So he's completed the mission conditions in terms of the um, standard conditions but as I said he's already got the mission so no big deal there. And that Tiger one's backing off so he really has to come right around the corner which will expose his sides to the uh, tanks up on the, um, the next road, so the KV-85 and the OI. So again, he's just waiting till he's reloaded. Just again, looking for the green dot. And you can see there, didn't penetrate the, um, the OI. So again, just you've got to look for that um, penetration indicator to, say, to show that you're going to penetrate. Otherwise, you'll need to try and use different uh, ammunition. And he's got the front of the OI, it looks like that will go through, he's just again finding that spot. No, didn't quite aim that one in. He's got quite a few targets in front of him, just wants that OI to back off. The OI's already lost a fair bit of health now, so he's not, as quite, not quite as keen to be facing. He really wants to put a round into this Tiger here, I think, so he wants to bait the shot and then um, move forward. Here he goes. Puts a big 817 into the um, Tiger there. So one more shot and the Tiger 1 will be down. That's taken Kami to 3.8k and he's blocked 5.7 already. So now he's going, alright, well, I can afford to move up here. Expose myself a bit to this Tiger, which he does, but now he's got the opportunity to delete the Tiger. Looks at the front plate, or in fact, the middle of the front plate, and that's gone. 
So again, you can see aiming is really important to using these um, heat rounds and HE rounds. Um, you've really got to look for that, that indicator. So, got two more tanks in front of him, the OI and this KV-85. I know you can get rid of the KV-85, no problem. It's got this gun to bear down and just delete another tank there. So there's only three vehicles left, which are all tank destroyers. The Yak Panther, Super Hellcat and T-25-2. And T-25-2 and the Hellcat both seen in the field. And the Yak Panther somewhere up ahead probably. Probably in a bush and uh, maybe looking their way. So this is something that he's going to have to deal with. We'll have to see. Uh, yeah, slow moving tank, so he's not going to be able to keep up too well with the um, the battle pace here. May not get another shot in. Uh, it's just seeing a pixel from the oh, there's the egg panther, and that shot just flies over the top. So just now the super Hellcat, which happens to be ballistics from Lemon Clan, and I think uh, Commie's basically given up the chase, he's just saying, right, gun up in the air, I'm happy with my results. Let's see what we can do with this. Now they need to win by capping or um, by killing all enemy tanks, so good chance he'll get the honours that he needs for this, and that will give him some extra rewards as well. So here we are, just going around a circle saying, yay, I've won, and that's the end of the game. All killed. Let's go and have a look at the detail. So another Ace Tanker Mastery badge there for Kami. He got the uh, high caliber award there for the most damage, doing 4.883k of damage, so nearly 4.9k, and the steel wall there for doing 5730 of blocking damage. And he also got the Cool Headed Award, which is about 10 ricochets or non pens in a row from enemy players, which relates to the blocking there. Uh, so really using his armor well there, um, compared to the team, 1458, yeah, nice level of base experience there. Um, we got Dick three kills and the next highest player was a T29, which is also a decent um, tier 7 tank, but only did 1415 and only got about half the XP that uh, Kami did. Uh, the enemy team there, the um, Super Hellcat at the end, um, Ballistics from Lemon Clan did uh, the most damage, but really, yeah, didn't do all that well in terms of the damage being needed. So, good result there for Kami. Uh, now, only 12 shots fired, but that's due to the long reload time, and he managed that well. Um, 10 of his shots actually hit, or a couple of wild shots there, um, which, uh, yeah course the misses and eight, eight out of his ten shots penetrated so gave him his damage total there and he did fire his heat rounds which are premium um, but he still made enough profit to uh, make a small profit that 8k there um, so a good result there for Kami. Anyway if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed already please consider subscribing we'll have more great content for you through the week and thanks for watching